terrible because I'm... Look at me! Look at me, hey. Fuck on me, yeah. Let's see if every single person watching this video can kick that like button down below. My fucking table is dirtier than my sense of humor. Okay. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hey, I should start each video by saying hello in a different language every single time. First one, we'll just go with French. Hola, como estes? Welcome to today's video, guys. And today, this has been a much anticipated video. Like I did that. I, I like I like doing the camera changes every once in a while, you know. And then whoa, oh, just, there's no. We have ventured into the world of toys many, many times on this channel. In these toy videos, I usually get extremely angry and frustrated with the toys because usually they can be extremely annoying. But today we are going somewhere that I never wanted to go because I this. <sighs> the toy that we're looking at today is by far the most annoying. <laughs> So annoying, it's giving me fucking throat cancer. This is by far one of the most annoying things on the internet. The most annoying things in this entire world of children's toys that I decided to venture into. And now, anytime I post a video that's not about toys, everybody's. Today marks the day that you have all been waiting for. I have read your comments, I have seen your cries. For Derek, all we want for you to do is this. I went to Toys R Us and spent over a hundred and fifty dollars. Minion toys. How many minions do you guys think are on this bag? I just counted them up and I want you guys to leave it in the comment section down below along with like your Twitter, your Instagram, or your Snapchat. And if you get it right, I will be adding you and following you. This isn't all that we got. We have, oh! Derek, one bag of toys? That's something that a fucking amateur piece of dog poo poo dingus fart balls would- You think that's all I got? <laughs> we got more! We got! The most boring, what the f was that? <laughs> and there's still another minion! We got a lot of minion stuff, this bag is full. We got these two, we're gonna be destroying, but oh, a lot, okay, so, um, <laughs> After you guys saw the Spider-Man video where I dressed up like Spider-Man and I told you guys I was doing a minion video, everybody said, Derek, you have to dress up like a minion for the minion video. Dressing up like Spider-Man is cool, but dressing up like a minion is just, I'm not willing to go that low. <laughs> I have some sort of morals behind my channel and my videos and me. I mean, dressing up like Spider-Man, he's a superhero, you know? I wouldn't dress up like a minion just for the thumbnail and just for me. Who do you guys think I am? retarded Spongebob. Okay, we're looking at minion toys. I'm not gonna be wearing this costume the entire time. One, because, um, there's some- I, I, these scare me. Like, these give me genuine fear. Like, imagine, like, me in your bedroom and- <laughs> It's Minion Derek here! <laughs> Man, good thing I dropped out of college for this. <laughs> oh my, these are gonna- Oh. Inside this minion bag, we got a bunch more. Oh my god, I can't. Inside this bag, we have one, a minion happy meal. We have this guy right here, who's a minion that you can dress up like a fucking banana, because we all know how much minions love bananas. We all know that cute song that the kids won't stop fucking singing, but it's so fucking awesome and cute. You just want to totally walk up to those kids and rip their fucking voice box up and say, ba 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 na na na. Now, we're taking these off because, um, the, uh, black dicks on my fingers are not fun. We have this, which is a bunch of balloons that's minion themed. This is a hundred water balloons that are minion themed. We'll have some fun with those as well. And we have the most exciting thing of all of this video. A ball. Um, it's, it's a, a ball that had minions on it, so I was like, oh. And we got this f***ing bag of So, let's open these toys. Do not attempt anything I'm about to do in this video. This is me after I just finished recording, and I realized, hey, you know what? I should probably tell people that this is f***ing stupid. So do not attempt any of this at home. Do not attempt to recreate this or anything. This is all for comedic person. <laughs> ha! 
Yeah, this is all just for fun for me to do and for you guys to watch, so do not attempt it and enjoy the video. Tons of you guys in my comments are always asking how you can get me to follow you on Instagram, so I just posted this picture on my Instagram and I am going to be following a dick ton! A dick ton of people who head over to that photo and comment on it with the banana emoji. Head over to that photo, comment the banana emoji, spam it as much as you can, follow me, like the photo, and I will be following a bunch of you guys back who do that. <laughs> We got our buddy Jail Time Carl here. How's it going, Carl? <laughs> he knows what's coming. I mean, he's already screaming for his life. <laughs> Everything you need to know about Carl um, is head moves. That's what had to put that on the fucking box, didn't they? Um, um, he requires two fucking batteries. Great, awesome. I cannot find my Swiss Army knife anywhere. My Swiss Army knife is really strong. It's really good for just like going ham on these boxes. So we're gonna have to use something that's not as strong as the Swiss Army knife. Sorry, Carl, you're not gonna get the super fun experience of the unboxing. We're gonna have to use this arm plate that I have that's meant for killing zombies. Oh my god! I perfectly dodged his fucking head. Look at that! Let's just Cutting his arm off, okay. Carl? It's not working on the downswing because I'm not using my samurai. Oh, there we go, that's it. That's it. Yep, we're fine. We're fine. This box is stronger than my freaking. Okay. Oh, there we go. Alright, buddy Carl. Carl's actually, he looks pretty cool. Carl? You gotta put batteries in your booty hole. Carl, you and me want to have a good relationship, you should know, just shut the f*** up, okay? <laughs> Carl, what would you like to say to the D-Squad for your very first and probably last video? Okay. Some of the things they advertise in the box for Mr. Carl here is he has movable arms, so... His, um, his arms move. Because he has the moving arms, if you flap them fast enough and throw him in the air, he will actually hover mid-air for a couple seconds and say a few funny lines. So, you go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then you throw him. And his eye, his eye moves back and forth too. And and that's all, he that's all this freaking thing does! Carl, I got a few surprises over there for you that um, you're probably not gonna fucking like. <laughs> so, if you want me to just put you back in your box and set you aside, just say anything, just don't laugh, because laughing is kinda rude. What do you want, do you want me to put you aside? <laughs> you fucked up, Carl! You're- oh, 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 Carl! This thing in the middle of the minion's face, some people may think of it as an eye, but when I look at the minion, I think of it kind of like a target. Like, it's just like the, 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 he's got- <laughs> Um, <laughs> I'm gonna set Carl down here for a second, and we're gonna see if I can hit him right on the target! Um, we'll use something that probably won't ruin the toy this early, because this is like the first part of the video, and I don't want to ruin the toy instantly, so let's- Use, oh, here we go. We will use uh, the pickaxe. Bitch, is you drunk? One laugh, you, you just don't laugh. I'll, I'll set you to the side. <laughs> Carl, you're such a. I missed the target. I missed the target. Car okay, you got. He's. He's fine. Okay. That was. I took it a little bit too far. I probably shouldn't have swung twice. I, I probably should have just left it with the one swing that I had. How you doing, buddy? You good? He's <laughs> Carl's just dead. He's dandy. He's dandy tastic. Carl, you still good? I think that means I'm 
I'm okay, Derek. Keep on going. I'm having fun. I got these bunch of balloons here, which is a bunch of water balloons that are minion themed. And you guys know that I love fire, so I thought, why not have a little bit of a challenge where we take our good buddy old pal Carl here. <laughs> we set him on fire, and then we see how many of these minion themed water balloons it will take for us to extinguish the fire. We're gonna see if we can save Carl before the fire engulfs his body and melts him into a little piece of fucking minion shit. So let's head outside and see if Carl is safe. First thing we gotta do is get all the balloons, and then we got our little buddy over there that we're gonna set on fire and see how many balloons it takes to put him out. Here we go. Dogs, shut the. We got 60 water balloons. Let's set our little friend Carl on fire. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Carl. <laughs> Let's see how many it takes. All right, Carl's face is on. Okay, here we go, guys. Let's go. Carl, I'm gonna save you, Carl. I missed completely. I missed again. Okay, Carl, you're gonna die. Um, oh. Oh. Carl, no, no. <laughs> I keep missing. Oh gosh, oh gosh, okay. Is he out? Is he out? <sighs> oh my gosh, there's still a little bit of smoke. There's still a little bit of smoke, guys. Oh, I'm gonna save you. <sighs> I have no idea how many balloons that was. <laughs> But is Carl safe? <laughs> Leave it in the comments section down below. How many balloons did I use? Cause I, um, no f***ing clue. No clue. I don't know how many balloons I had to use on Carl, but, um, he would, this is what he looks like now. I d don't hate me, I did not mean, I tried to save him, okay? I missed My aim is terrible. It's... <sighs> Carl, I have not tried this yet, but there is no doubt in my mind that this f***er is not gonna work anymore. Please, by the grace of God, maybe, but his innards are done. His innards have been burnt. <laughs> I think the reason that Carl still works is Carl, you know, Carl, out of all the toys I've ever dealt with, I think Carl has the best sense of humor. Like, this guy just loves to laugh. <laughs> And because he loves to laugh and he's just such a nice guy, I think Carl got understood that that was just a joke! <laughs> now we're gonna be taking a look at the Light Up Fluffy. This thing is so freaking like, just look at the eyes! <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Oh, I just wanna set you on fire and make sure you're never cute ever. Get out! How for this fluffy thing, you basically have to give it like a mini abortion to get the freaking battery pack out. Shove that freaking battery pack back into her stomach. Lullaby mode. When it's time for bed, quickly press the hoof button twice to activate Lulla. Her magical charm of fluffy little glow to dim to help you fall asleep. What the f I want to lullaby mode. I want to fall asleep. This thing is so creepy. Like look at those eyes. <laughs> There's a little hole in its ass. Huh. You can insert a USB chip and you can actually put your own sounds onto Fluffy. I put a few sounds of my own in, so I'll show you guys right now. Here we go. Ready? And his name is John C. <laughs> Here's the next one. Fuck the police coming straight from the underground. A young man. And uh, one more. My little pony. My little pony. I know what that is. A little game of flamethrower spin roulette. What I'm gonna do is we're gonna give Fluffy a chance, guys. Usually, I don't give these toys a chance at all. As you can see back there, the massacred uh, graveyard of toys, usually I just burn them and they just die. But we're gonna do three rounds. I'm going to close my eyes and spin around for about 20 seconds until I have no idea where I am and I'm gonna try and aim for Fluffy. We're gonna do this three times and if I don't hit her, if I miss every single time, she's good to go and she can live on her stupid fucking life as this duck. She got a big booty, so I call a big booty. And if she catches on fire, which she might, 
and then we're gonna have a great time, and it's gonna be tons of fun. So, here we go! Flame Thrower Spin Roulette! As an example, I'm gonna go da 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 and then wherever I land... Oh, that was... Um... <laughs> the first contestant ever on Flame Thrower Roulette, we have... Little Miss Fluffy! Uh, Fluffy, how you feeling today? Are you ready for this game? <laughs> Okay, round number one, let's get to spinning and let's see if Fluffy survives. Here we go! Oh, I shot it off! I shot it off! Damn it! I gotta aim lower when I'm doing this. Round number two, here we go. I'll never forget this day. If I miss this, she stays safe, and you guys don't get to see a burning unicorn on my video today. I'm doing this for all the loyal D squad out there. Let's freaking go. Some water on standby there. <coughs> <coughs> it smells like burnt dead children. <laughs> Not that I know that what that smells like, because I wouldn't know what a burnt child smells like unless I've dealt with burnt child. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so Fluffy had a little bit of a makeover. Uh, <laughs> she has a nice black mohawk now, but her horn is completely destroyed. And I'm gonna try the button, but there's no way this thing's. No fuck! She literally is f This is her back, okay? This is what the fuck happened to freaking Fluffy! Uh, we got off to a little bit of a rocky start, but I think now that we've gone through this bonding relationship of playing the uh, fire roulette spin game, I think we're a lot closer now, and I think we can move on as friends. What do you think about that, Fluffy? <laughs> Look at the top of his head! <laughs> Next up, we have Kevin the Banana Build a minion. I think it's time to bring out an old friend to open up Kevin. <laughs> when I say old friend, I mean um, my good old Swiss Army knife because I've used this Swiss Army knife so many times in videos that it's kind of become legendary and we're gonna use this. Just kidding. Oh, I nailed him right on the fucking head. <laughs> Kevin, come out and play! So this Kevin Minion toy doesn't say anything, it is- all you do is you dress it up as different things, so you- like here you have this jacket you can put on him, so there, wow, look at that! That's an amazing investment right there, good thing I bought this one, he doesn't do sh** at all! You can put the jacket on him, you know, you can take the jacket off, and then throw it away because you're never gonna use it. If you want for some f***ing reason, you can turn this guy literally into a banana! This is a banana minion! Kevin's my little buddy here, and I would never want to harm him, but I asked you guys on Twitter what I should do to this minion toy, and I gave you guys a bunch of choices, and the top choice that you guys picked was a chain saw. I asked my stepdad if he would be willing to saw this minion toy in half, and he was surprisingly more than willing. He's not even blood related to me, so it's not like he has any of my angry toy destroying genes in him, but maybe I'm rubbing off on him a little bit. Kevin, I'll give you the same treatment I gave Carl. All you have to do, if you don't want me to do this to you, just speak up and say anything and we won't do it. So Kevin, what do you think? <laughs> no, we're doing it anyway, Kevin, let's go.
that video of Kyle getting sliced was fake. He's completely a um, This is actually perfect because you have a daughter and a son and you don't have a lot of money. Buy one Kyle. <laughs> Oh, here we go, here we go, Carl, you ready? You ready, buddy? Oh, here we go, Carl! Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, here's a good... <laughs> okay. So I went to McDonald's and grabbed a minion fucking Happy Meal. I thought it'd be just a little bit of nostalgia for me to open up a Happy Meal and look at the toy because I haven't gotten a Happy Meal toy in so long, but... I also thought it'd be fun to give myself a little bit of a challenge here to see if I can eat the Happy Meal faster than anybody has ever eaten it. If you guys know a YouTuber named Matt Stoney, he has like the world record for the fastest Happy Meal. So I'm gonna compare his Happy Meal to mine side by side and see who is faster. So the toy they gave us is this Despicable Me toy. So the toy you do this. Bye, Felicia. Oh, so oh God. Fuck this shit, I'm mad. So yeah, that's all, that, that's a Happy Meal toy right there's nothing I would rather have than this amazing Happy Meal toy. Why does it still work? Oh, you're supposed to die! Die! There, thank you! Alright guys, fastest Happy Meal ever eaten. Here we go. This is the start of my fast eating career. Here we go, ready? Three, two, one! This is probably one of the most successful toy reviews I've ever done because all three of these toys still work. They look great. I don't think great is the right word for me to be using in this situation. If you ever want to see behind the scenes of my videos, be sure to add me on Snapchat. I'm always posting stuff behind the scenes of my videos, before I do my videos, little sneak peeks, and all that stuff. I hope you enjoyed meeting the new members of our team here, the Minions, the Despicable Me stuff. They weren't that bad. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day. Always remember the motto of do good die great. Um, that model doesn't really make sense for this video because I'm literally just destroying stuff and wasting money, but I'm, you know, kick that like button. <laughs> all right, have a fantastic day. I will see you all very soon from Fluffy, Kyle, and Carl.